Ow! <laughs> Whoops. Oh. Hey, it's Brickzar, and it's time for a classic Lego debate. Which do you like? Old gray or blue gray? So what you playing there? Oh, uh, I'm just playing some Sky Wars on Minecraft. Okay. Oh, I'm about to. I'm going to ask you a question. What is it going to be? What is your favorite social media site? Probably Instagram or YouTube. Oh, actually, no, it's YouTube. <laughs> I was about to say, uh, <laughs> what, what, the two you use the most are Instagram and YouTube. Why do you pick YouTube over Instagram as maybe your favorite? Uh, mainly because it's one that I, it's my first one. Yeah. I like being able to share videos. Yeah, me too. It's really fun. All right. So the vlog every day topic for today is what is your favorite social media site? And it has to be YouTube for me. I don't even think I would be on social media <laughs> if it wasn't for YouTube, uh, other than maybe checking what my kids were up to. Because I rarely ever used Instagram. In fact, I think all of my social media accounts outside of Facebook, um, yeah, everything, no, I take it back, everything came after YouTube. Uh, I think it was the first one I actually signed up for back in 2007, and although I did use Facebook occasionally, I hated Facebook, so I never really used it that much, and then all my other social media ties uh, pretty much were made so I could promote YouTube, so yeah, definitely for me, YouTube is my favorite. Alright, so this is going to be a bet, Brigzar answer thingy. Alright, so Lego Man 12345, 12345 <laughs> asked, which do we prefer, old gray or the bluish grays, the dark or the um, light grays? And I got Flash, which is be bricks. in disguise there. So he was sneaking into the video. In case you don't know, who is They Might Be Bricks? The Flash. Okay. All right, so uh, the train that just went by, it was two trains that got stuck together. We had the Santa Fe train and the Metro Liner, which are both in what color? They might be bricks. The old light gray. Yes, they're old light gray. And they do, uh, the uh, Santa Fe tra train also has old dark gray in it. And that is a really a sore subject for some of us uh, longtime Lego collectors. Uh, if you collected classic space that began in 1978, you would get in some of the sets these base plates like this. And all the grays were this color, this old light gray. This base plate here, right there, that's the new gray. Light bluish gray. Yeah, and that's what we call it. That Lego doesn't call it bluish gray. We call it bluish gray uh, Lego collectors. But it's a little bluer mm -hmm. <laughs> and brighter than the more duller but more I think better <laughs> color of old gray I like the old gray better than the bluish gray but Lego did their um, those little studies that they do and it was determined that I don't know if it had to do with cost of the dyes but it just determined they would switch to these bluish colors in the um, with the gray and the dark gray. So it kind of was a bummer to a lot of us that had been collecting classic space, classic castle, and trains, because now if you wanted to add, expand your creations, the colors were different. Uh, totally, the color totally does not match the Santa Fe train, doesn't match the Metro liner, doesn't match any of the classic space, So and it doesn't match any of the classic castle. So that became a problem for people that were they're making creations and I know some people that got pretty upset back in the day and said they weren't going to buy any more Lego sets but they did I think for the most part <laughs> but what do you think do you like these old the old gray or the new gray in fact this train track that we have this is most of it is the old dark gray and you'll find places I'm trying to figure out if there's a place on this layout where I use some of the bluish gray do, oh, did I pass it? It's a rail. 
Oh, that's a rail. I'm talking about with the actual 9 volt track. There's a difference. There's a switch track there that you can barely tell. So some will say, well, the difference isn't as noticeable, but it, I, it is to me right there. There, that track there is bluish gray instead of dark gray. So it just causes some problems, especially if you're OCD. But if you're OCD, I'm not OCD, but it's still, um, yeah, I don't like it. So what do you think they might be bricks? I mean, it's okay for me. It could be worse, like you know how they changed the color of the green base plates. Oh, that was terrible. Yeah. Yeah, they totally did away with green for they, the base plate. They could have changed this to like a worse gray color. Yeah. Like a gray that looked tan. Yeah. So, some people ask, you know, how do you tell them apart? Well, go buy a set that came out today <laughs> that has gray or dark gray or the brown, and those are the new colors. If it, And then if you use that as a reference, if you get a brown that's slightly different or a gray that's slightly different or a dark gray that's slightly different, that's going to be the old stuff that was produced from 2004 uh, and beyond or earlier do you know that uh i had bought i'm trying to think of what set it was uh one of the early star destroyers do you remember the lego star destroyer mm -hmm. yes it actually had both colors in it that's weird bluish gray <laughs> and uh old gray well that, well, that was kind of weird so there were a couple of sets that i remember getting that had both colors in them so anyway tell me what your preference is and let's let these trains go uh oh Ow! <laughs> Whoops. Well, also, <laughs> I, I was on these pieces and then one of them fell on the track like that. Oh, you're the one that derailed no, it. No, I didn't derail it. No, oh. listen.